Hey, what is going on guys? So today I'm gonna show you all of my spin cubes versus my spin balls, guys. But also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but check this out. I did an unboxing the other day and I, I have a couple of these necklaces. The thing is like you think that these are spinners because on the website it says spinner necklace. So you have like this like dragon eye thing and then you know you have a bunch of these dragon eye spinners as well. So you think that you can go ahead and attach it in a necklace as like a holder and then when you want to take it off you can unattach it and you can spin it. Well guess what? They never show you the back of it. It's freaking hollow. You know what I think about this? Who is really going to wear this necklace around the public? Seriously, like, hey, 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 hey what's up, guys? <laughs> oh, that's what I think of this necklace. Look at this. It's freaking hollow. Like, what are you going to, like, who's going to wear this, like, necklace around? Seriously, are you guys going to, like, I mean, is this cool to wear a necklace like this? Is it, is this cringy to wear something like this? Look at this. I'm not wearing this, okay? It's not a spinner, it's nothing. It's, it, this is like trash to me. Anyways, let's get to the real business. All right, so let's get to business, guys. I apologize. I, I ripped this and I actually, I hurt my neck pretty bad. I got a, like a really deep red mark on the back of my neck. Didn't really realize this thing was so strong, but I'm still able to like fix this. I feel kind of bad for breaking this, but I mean, I'm not gonna wear this, okay? All right, spin cubes, spin balls. All right, let's go ahead and go over some of the varieties that I have here. And let me know which one you guys like best, okay? I'll probably do more giveaways. I know I've done a, a lot of giveaways on these smaller ones. These are probably my favorite out of all these here. And we'll actually go over why, but some of you guys will probably like the soccer ball. And I guess we'll start with this one here. But the soccer ball here, this is pretty cool because you can spin it anyway, okay? You can grab it anyway in any of the uh, fingertips here and they spin, but it spins best if you hold the black. It just spins a lot smoother. I think the bearing is in like that way. And there's actual bearings in here too, guys. You can see that. And this is heavy, guys. Don't think that this is like light. Like I thought about doing giveaways on this, but I don't want nobody to hurt themselves or like throw this at somebody. Let me show you the weight of this. You, I mean, this is like pretty important, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on grams. And this thing, this thing is easily over 100 grams, guys. Oh my goodness, it's 115 grams. That is pretty heavy. You know, the standard um, spinner, everybody's familiar with a standard spinner. These are about 50, uh, 50 grams on, on average, okay? All right, this one's exactly 50 grams. But these are about 50 grams. This one is over 100, okay? This thing can literally like knock somebody out. And of course, like you, you can buy them separately like this. I also bought it where it came with the stand. This is pretty cool. And this is actually like aluminum. I thought this was plastic when I first bought this like set together, but it's actually metal as well. And the only thing about these is, you know, if you, if you don't have like a stand in your plane, you know, if you really like these, like it's always, these balls are always just gonna roll off your desk or just look, these, they're always like rolling somewhere. Look at, look at earth, earth just like, what, 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 off the camera now look see so that, that's kind of annoying for me I guess if you have the stand but you're not always probably going to have like this like little stand here uh, anyway so that's just the this kind of soccer ball and of course this one here is the same thing it's just a different color which I kind of like this one too this one kind of looks cool and this is like the same weight and then you have something a little bit smaller you can see here this one here is a little bit smaller kind of have that oriental design on here this one's pretty cool I like the way this one looks you can see how this looks. Actually, I think this would be like a nice home decor if you have it, you know, using this stand here like that. That's pretty cute. And we have the rainbow uh, ball here, you can see. And this one only, you can only spin it on two sides like that, you know, and these are kind of hard. It's kind of, you know, for, for a lot of you guys, you might have issues like spinning this with one hand, okay? But this is the only thing you can do is you can just spin it like that and that's pretty much it. You want to put it down and it's just going to end up like rolling off somewhere. Uh, and, and, and we have little earth. Now this one's a little bit different now. This is actually pretty cool. I think I paid like 13 bucks for this one. I didn't realize how small it was going to be. But here's earth and this is like um, called the uh, something orbit. But they have it in like uh, earth, 
You could buy the other planets. I think they have Saturn and Mars. So this is supposed to be Earth. Now the thing about this one is different is the thumb caps here are is flat here. So what's different about this one here is you can actually lay it flat like this and you can go ahead and give it a little spin. And you can, of course you can do it in your hands. And it's a little, the indention here, so you can kind of bounce it on your finger too, like, oops. I mean, the finger thing is so small, it's kind of even hard for me to like balance it, but you can, so you, you know, basically, you can actually play with this a little bit more. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> so that's little earth here. Those are the spin balls. And let's go with the spin cubes here now, okay? Now the thing is with the spin cubes, I mean, let me just show you. I'm going to line up the ones that I like best. I like the metal, the aluminum ones that are this size here, okay? Wow, isn't that awesome? I got like tons of different colors here. And then, oh, I even have pink. These are my favorite ones, okay? So let me just go over these ones here. Now, these ones here are plastic. Sometimes, you know, you go ahead and you go on a website, you want a spin cube, and sometimes they don't tell you, is it a metal one or is it a plastic one? Like these, I thought... Uh, they were metal, but they were like pretty inexpensive compared to these. But I thought, I thought uh, when I ordered this one, I thought it was metal. But it's it's plastic, but it's just like a, a glossy, so you can't really tell in photos. And some of these plastic ones, you'll be able to take these um, these side things off, and you'll be able to spin this on the table as well. I'll show you in one second. But this plastic one doesn't. This one is just a it's just a little toy. It's not that bad. I mean, it's super super light. I mean, you know what? Let's let's go ahead and just for kicks and giggles. Let's go ahead and weigh this. All right, so we know that that big ball was like 115 grams. This one here, look at that. It's 21 grams versus like 115 grams on this one. And this one doesn't really do anything. It's just a plastic, but it sounds cool too. You hear that plastic? So I think this one's even okay for kids. And then this one here is kind of a glossy finish here. And let me see if this one comes apart too. And if it comes apart, we'll be able to spin on the table. Okay, this one doesn't. I'll put that to the side. Let me see how much uh, these like well, these aluminum ones here. Okay, so they're about 63 grams, as you can see. Let me put that to the side. And here's another black one here. Let me see if this black one comes. Okay, this one maybe comes off. Are you kidding me? I thought I had one that, a plastic one that, comes off. Sometimes they're held on by magnets, sometimes they hold, they're held on by threads. Like here, here's another aluminum one here. And they, these all come in different size, guys. You know, and, and take a look at this too. Even if you wanted to get something that's, um, you think is like similar, like let's say I go ahead and show you guys this one on a video and you're like, oh my goodness, I want this gold one. Let me go on the internet and find a company that sells it. Then you find something, you know, you find this and you think it's the same thing. And actually it's not, okay? Because Look at the, uh, you see the, they're about the same size cubes, but look at the, uh, these rollers here. You can see like one's way bigger than the other, see? Look, this one here is way bigger than this one, see? But I mean, to me, it doesn't make a difference. They both, if you spin both of these, regardless if it's the smaller one or the bigger one, they still feel pretty good. These are awesome. And some of these you'll be able, some of them are just hooked up by magnets. All right, this one's hooked up by a magnet, okay? I kind of like the magnet ones better. Some of them have threads. I guess it's kind of safer, but I mean, for me, I just like the magnets. It's just easier to pull apart. And then if you're bored, you know, you have, you can see the bearing in here too. You can still kind of spin this around as well. And then you have this top here, this tabletop. You can go ahead, if you're bored, you just want to fidget around, kill some time, or think about the, your next YouTube video. You can go ahead and like spin these as well. And some of them actually, they're not going to have the magnets. Okay, I think this one has threads. This one may, okay, may, okay, yeah. See, this one has threads. So some of them are a little bit, they're a little bit different. Um, I really don't think either of them, I mean, I personally, I really don't have a preference on either of those. But you can see the bearing here and see, and this one has like threads. So this one, if you want to connect it, you just have to, you know, I mean, you have to obviously you have to screw it back in, so it just takes a little bit longer. So if, if I had to pick one, I would just go with the uh, the aluminum one because it's just faster. You know, you're sitting here playing around with this like on your desk or thinking about something, and uh, somebody calls you downstairs and you're like, oh no, I gotta 
I gotta hurry up and like bring this with me, put this in my pocket and jump in the car and then shh, you're ready to rock and roll. Anyways, I have some other colors here too. You can see this nice little blue one. And some of them are like different sizes too. You know, it's like, let me see here. See like this one, like these two here, like this blue one is a little bit smaller, but I mean, they're both aluminum. They both feel great in the hand. This gray one too is like nice as well. And then of course I got some like rainbows here and these are both different sizes too, look. You have to look closely. They are different sizes, okay? This one here is smaller, but they both still spin pretty well. Anyways, I'm going to cut this video right here. Guys, let me know which one you like. Maybe I'll work out some kind of giveaway. Maybe I won't. You guys know how I roll. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.